dear learners, nice to meet you. I'm glad to be part of your journey in learning mathematics with so much fun and excitement. Mathematics, first quarter, Moodle 1, which is about fractions, is designed as a supplementary material in mathematics intended for you. Lesson 1 talks about addition of fractions. Do you know how to add fractions? If not, don't worry because I am here to help you learn about fractions. I will help you learn better Anderson fractions and find it interesting, useful, and challenging. Lesson 1 is about addition of fractions. It is divided into four parts. The first part is about addition of whole numbers and fractions. Are you ready? Now, let's start and have fun! Before we will go further, take the simple test to review about the different types of fractions. Let's begin! First question. Which of the following sets of numbers are similar fractions? One half, two thirds, four sevenths. One eighth, two fifths, five sevenths. Three tenths, four tenths, five tenths. Correct. The answer is letter C. Three tenths, four tenths, and five tenths. These are similar fractions. Remember, similar fractions are fractions with the same denominators. Second question. Which of the following sets of numbers are the similar fractions? Is it A, one-third, two-fifths, four-sevenths? B, one-fifth, three-fifths, four-fifths? Or is it letter C, one-ninth, two-ninths, three-ninths? You got it! The answer is letter A. Don't forget, the similar fractions are fractions with different denominators. Third question. Which of the following sets of fractions are mixed numbers? A. 2 and 2 fourths, 5 and 2 thirds, 1 and 1 ninth. B. 1 fifth. 3 fifths, 4 fifths, C, 1 ninth, 2 ninths, 3 ninths. Correct! The answer is letter A. Don't forget, mixed numbers are composed of a whole number and a fraction. Number 4. Which of the following is a proper fraction? 7 fourths, 2 fifths, or 9 ninths. Very good! The answer is 2 fifths. 2 fifths is a proper fraction. Proper fraction is a type of fraction wherein numerator is smaller or lesser than the denominator. The numerator, which is 2, is smaller then our denominator, which is 5. Number 5. Which of the following is an improper fraction? Is it 1 fourth, 8 thirds, or 2 ninths? Correct! The answer is 8 thirds. 8 thirds is an improper fraction. Improper fraction is a type of fraction wherein the numerator is greater than the denominator or it could be the numerator is equal to the denominator. Now, let's find out how to add whole numbers and fractions. Let us take this example. Add 3 and 1 half. Let's picture out. How many holes are there? Yes, 
there are three holes. One, two, and three. How about in the other side? The other one is divided into two. Half is shaded. That is one half of the whole. So three plus one half is equal to three and one half. What do you notice when we added a whole number and a fraction together? If we answer it that we got a mixed number as sum, then you are correct. Mixed number is composed of whole number and a fraction. In here, the whole number is 3 and a fraction is 1 half. Now, it's your turn. Let's take another example. Add 9 and 3 fourths. 9 plus 3 fourths equals 9 and 3 fourths. 9 is the whole number and 3 fourths is the fraction. This is what we call mixed numbers. Now, it's your turn. Let's try this. Number 1. 12 plus 1 fifth equals... Correct. 12 and 1 fifth. 2. 8 plus 4 sevenths equals... Very good. The answer is 8 and 4 sevenths. Number 3. 7 plus 1 fourth equals... You're right. The answer is 7 and 1 fourth. Remember, whole number added to fraction is equal to a mixed number. You are able to learn how to add whole number in fractions? Are you ready to learn for another lesson? Proceed to the next part of this lesson which is adding similar fractions. Congratulations! You're done in the first part of this lesson. You got it!